Hello, my unknown friend. Let's talk about trajectories. To activate trajectories, you must first select a part of the timeline and then click on the trajectory icon. Trajectories are used to check the smoothness of the arcs in your animation. There are many different types of trajectories here. But let's talk about the simplest version of trajectories. Parent trajectories. You can select any point in the rig and check how smooth the arc is on this section of the animation. If you need to check or compare trajectories of two or more points, select All Trajectories mode and compare. After that, you can make the trajectory smooth and correlated, if you will be lucky enough. To lock the trajectory, you need to activate the lock icon and this will lock the selected trajectories. That will allow you to select other points, but the locked trajectories will remain visible. You can also activate trajectories only on keyframes by clicking the key icon. You can use trajectories in any mode, in point controller mode or in uh, auto posing mode. And by the way, to select the whole sequence, uh, you just can press the name of the track here and the, all the trajectories for whole sequence will be visible. You can also edit trajectories in trajectory edit mode. For that you need to select point controller mode and activate trajectories edit mode. It doesn't work for some reason. Yeah, now it's possible. But when you try to move exactly the frame where is your playhead, nothing will happen. Uh, but if you move other frame, you will see that everything is work because timeline changed to fix it. And in that mode, you can manipulate with your trajectories. To manipulate all the trajectories, you need to change whole sequence to fix it mode. If you select select the whole sequence and press fix it, you will be able to manipulate trajectories in any part of your sequence. You can select the part of trajectories and manipulate and change it like a whole part of trajectories like this. Yeah. And that's it for trajectories for now. I hope it was helpful and see you in the next video, guys. Bye.